super hot today. I needed to find somewhere with a lot of shade, so that means creek fishing. So I'm out here at this creek that I always come to. Uh, I haven't been here in a few months though. And uh, in the last couple of weeks, we've had a lot of rain. And this place flooded really badly. In fact, where I'm standing, at one point, you can see the debris and stuff on the trees here. And I'm up like 10 feet above the water level right now. And that this was all underwater. Uh, there was uh, the road down the street here under the highway the water level got up so high under there it washed up some big trees and stuff across the road that was pretty crazy uh, but it wasn't up for very long so my goal is to come out here and see if I can find any fish like maybe the fish got washed away or more of them got washed in um, although when I was pulling up there was a couple of ladies leaving that had a bucket full of fish so um, I think they were just catching like sunfish and stuff though water is a little bit stained it's good clarity though there's some bait fish swimming around so. let's get my rods and stuff and try to get onto some fish here I'm gonna go back to a couple of spots that I know where there were fish before and see if those fish are still there oh there's some bass right there I see one swimming in that Right there, so I'm gonna come down on this side. It's really hard to catch the bass here because the sunfish will come and take it from them. Got one. Just the sunfish still. But I actually got him. Sunfish. I just got a text from my girlfriend telling me to go pick her up. And she's not much of a fisherman, so. I don't know if the camera can pick this up or not, but there's all these, like, I don't know if they're seeds, and it looks like fur floating around. Actually, here you go. It's in the spider web. All this stuff is stuck in the spider web. Like I have to cover my mouth so I don't breathe any in, they're everywhere. <clears throat> yep, there's a fish, right there. And the sunfish came and took it away from the bass. There was a decent bass there. <laughs> the sunfish came and took it. That's frustrating. See, there's a at least a two pound bass hanging out over there. But you can't catch it because you got to deal with these guys. Stupid fish. Whoa. That is really amazing. Come on, you can get away. You're good. That, that's the coolest thing ever. Like I dropped the fish and the owl came and took it from me. And there's a good bass right there too. It's not the same bass, it's a smaller one. Um, if I didn't get that on video, I don't think anybody would have believed me. Let me throw out in front of this bass real quick. God, stupid sunfish. The bass was about to take it and the sunfish grabbed it. And the sunfish just pulled it off the hook. Anyway, that was probably one of the coolest things that's ever happened to me out fishing. And for anybody wondering there, the, when the owl grabbed that the fish there and he tried to take off and he fell into the water, it's because his feet got caught up on whatever these plants are. 
it kind of looked like he was stuck to a rope or fishing line but it was just the plant and then when he was able, when he was able to get back up out of the water he got away okay uh i wanted to stick around and fish a little bit more i've only been here for about half an hour but i was able to catch two sunfish unfortunately i couldn't catch any bass I, I did see several though which is a really good sign because i haven't seen that many bass here in a long time uh, but what's actually going to make this an interesting video is that owl swooping in out of nowhere and grabbing my fish so that was that was one of the coolest things coolest things that's ever happened to me while i'm out fishing so and then he kind of like posed and stared at the camera there for a minute so usually when i see cool things like that happening the camera's not on or it's not pointed in the right direction but he came and was right in front of the camera the whole time so hopefully the video came out good i gotta get back across this busy street and uh yeah the girlfriend's waiting on me so i gotta hurry up all right thanks for watching i'll see you next time